In this lesson, we'll be looking at transformations. Now, transformations is not a topic on its own. It's a it's a mixture of structures that you have to know and understand well. For example, says the boy is John. He broke the window last week. John. Begin with John. So if you begin with John, you need to construct a sentence such a way that you do not change the meaning of the first sentence. So the, the answer is, John is a boy. Of course John is a boy. Who did what? Who broke the window last week? Now remember always not to forget to put a full stop at the end of each transformation that you like. Question 1 says, in your place, I would ask for a transfer to another school. In your place, I would ask for a transfer to another school. Begin if. So if is a condition. So if I where are you? If I where are you? Comma. I would ask for a transfer transfer to another school we haven't changed the meaning of the sentence it still remains the fact that someone would ask for a transfer if he or she was in someone's place that's what actually that's the answer Two says, as we were chatting under a tree by the roadside, a car nearly hit us. Chatting, so this type of transformation, this is how you answer them. Chatting under, chatting under a tree, comma, we were, Sorry, chatting under a tree by the roadside. Comma. We were near hit by a car. And that's how you answer them. Don't answer, do not say chatting under a tree by the roadside a car near hit us you, you you are changing the meaning now you are now saying you almost hit the car so what to what to say it if you are chatting under a tree you were near hit by a car then put a full stop three says since you have completed grade 12 comma you can go to the game park for a holiday now begin now 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 when you put now you need to consider that you, you, you need to add that at some point so now that you have completed return come on you can go to the get back a hurry full stop now that since the word since he has been changed into now that that's what you must know what since means my parents forced me to go to school my parents made me go to to school Or my parents made me go to school by force because you are forced. Either way, they are all correct. I don't know if my friends will come tomorrow. 
said John. Now these are quotations. These are quotations. John wondered. When you wonder, you always include something. If John wondered if his my changes to his friends. We are now reporting friends. John wondered if his friend will changes to old. John wondered if his friend would come. Now tomorrow changes to yesterday. You are now reporting. No, so it now tomorrow changes to the following day because we are now reporting. Like I don't know if my friends are coming next week or maybe uh, tomorrow. You have to say and if I am now reporting that what John said, I'll say. John didn't know if his friends were, were, were going to come the following day. To come the following day. Would come the following day. So take note of such uh, weddings. Question 6 says, He is a cousin and a good friend of mine. Not only. So this person is is two things to this person a cousin also a good friend so not only is he a cousin comma but he is also a good friend of mine not only is he a cousin, but he is also a good friend of mine. Many people make a mistake where they say, not only is he a cousin, he is also a good friend of mine. No, you put the word but. Not only is he a cousin, he is also a good friend of mine. It is arranged that he stole from his neighbor. So he allegedly stole from his neighbor. Both the biology textbook and the history textbook were in bad shape. Neither. Now, when dealing with neither, you need to know that at some point you need to put no. You need to put this word no at some point. So, neither, neither the biology textbook nor the history textbook now when you use neither you are now talking about independent books they are not together now so we're going to use instead of well we're going to use was in in good shape why have i used was and in good shape when you say neither you say nothing among the books nothing was in, was in good shape and that's what they are saying everything was in bad shape she don't she don't know the answer she doesn't know the answer that is why she's doubting so when you say if that means if she knew if she if she knows if she knows the answer comma she wouldn't be doubting The last one, the building seems to be on fire. It appears that, you always start with that, so it appears that the building, it appears that the building is where on fire. So thanks so much for watching. Make sure you revise. Where you have a question, please don't hesitate to ask.